Hi, this is Holly with Holly Volpe Interior Design and I am so excited to share with you today a recent project I just completed. So come on in and let me show you around. So upon entering the house, one of the design features that I want to point out, which I absolutely love, is this textured wallpaper. When you're designing a home, I feel that it's very important to add some really, really unique design elements. And one of the things I love to do is include texture in every single room that I do. And one of the other things I like to do when I'm designing is, if we have a monochromatic color palette, which we do with the blue and the whites all throughout the house, I like to kind of create a little bit of a splash of color. I think it's important and adds a lot of dimension. So if you look in the foyer here, I've added a little bit of celery green in a couple of the accessories that are spaced out amongst the console. So as we go into the great room, you'll see a little bit of that threaded throughout as well. So now that we're in the great room, I want you to take notice of, I did thread the celery color green throughout, added a little bit of pop into this room by just simply adding some throw pillows to the sofa. I threw in a little bit of pattern to give us a little bit more of a punch. And we of course have to have a little bit of texture. So what I did was I added some stone to a very simple, sophisticated built-in wall unit and it gives us that three-dimensional look. With keeping the theme of texture, I added another beautiful grass cloth wallpaper above this custom seating area. And I didn't want to take away from the beautiful cushions, so I wanted it to be very simple. So it's another grass cloth and it's got an iridescence to it and it's in a white and it reminds me of seashells down by the seashore. So again, very minimalistic, behind the scenes, little architectural feature that I added that I absolutely love. So when you're designing a kitchen, I do like to take into account my client's dishes because I think it's so important. There's nothing like having a beautiful kitchen designed and then not having the right dishes to be placed out when you're ready to set the table. So I have gone ahead and I've used my client's dishware and I've set this beautiful table and maybe to some this isn't what you would do on an everyday basis, but it is nice to know that when you do want to set that special table that you have all the right dishes in order to make it do so. Another one of my favorite spaces in this house is this small office. Now, when we think of small, we think of, oh, what are we going to do in there? Well, this office packs a lot of punch in more than one way. So let's take a peek at what I've done in this beautiful little office. We made this office functional and fun all at the same time. We had a custom wall unit installed for maximum storage and also so that the customer could display a lot of her fun favorite things. We also did a beautiful custom chair and rug where we handpicked the color scheme that we wanted to create. And once again, we've threaded a little bit of the seashore into our room. And lastly, if not my most favorite thing in this room, is the ceiling. We carried the purple color to add a little bit of pop and kept the glass and the crystal look on the ceiling fixture. Now we're on the second floor, which is the main living quarters, and I want to share with you our first guest bedroom. So we already know that the homeowner loves the color purple, so I wanted to keep a little bit of that upstairs. So in my first bedroom, we added a sprinkle of purple and we kept it very neutral with the same grays that you've seen throughout the house color palette. We are now in guest bedroom number two and we have our celery green slash aqua color theme sprinkled into this room once again. And what we've done here is we've added some artwork that to me had a reminiscence of sand dollars down at the seashore. One of the things I really want to point out is the Sfera linens. I use them throughout the house. They're one of my favorite bedding lines that I actually sell in my store, TriSpace Interiors, and you will see them threaded throughout this video. They are absolutely stunning. They're beautiful, good quality, highly recommend them and love them so much. Welcome to the master bedroom. This room has almost every color that you've just seen throughout the house. We have the navy blue, we have whites, we have grays, we have sea green, and we even threw in a little bit of a sand tone, once again that reminds me of being down at the shore. Now we're heading up to the loft, another one of my favorite little places in this home. Now, my clients wanted to make sure that the loft was designed for their grandchildren. 
So we wanted to create a space that could grow with the children and not be too juvenile, but not be too sophisticated. So this room is the sitting room. So this is a room where the kids can sprawl out. They can watch TV, curl up in, in the nook, read a book. And this has a pullout sofa for extra sleeping when they have extra company. We are still in the loft and this is the sleeping area. We have added some beautiful bunk beds and the bunk bed also has a trundle on the bottom that can pull out for extra sleeping. And of course, we still have a little representation of being down by the beach. We have Moby Dick on our books and we also have this cute little anchor weight. I added this cute little tent in this little niche. And what child doesn't like to play hide and go seek? In fact, I still like to play hide and go seek with my own kids. So this is a cute little way that you can take something and add it to a little nook that you can change out once again as the children grow. So we're still up in the loft and we are in the bathroom. One of the things I'd really love to point out is this enormous tortoise print. This is a triptych. It's 48 inches in length, 24 inches wide, and it fills up a massive wall absolutely beautifully. And once again, we're bringing the outdoors in. So we are gonna head down now to the basement, but instead of taking the stairs, we're gonna take the elevator. I'd like to thank my clients for allowing me to share with you their beautiful home. This is Holly with Holly Volpe Interior Design, and until next time.